Welcome back viewers. In this video we're going to talk about an upgrade I have made to the hydroponic system. If you have purchased my build guide on how to build this hydroponic garden, you may recall from chapter 9 I mentioned installing a screen filter to catch debris to prevent growth channels from plugging. I've tested out a DIY screen filter and will be sharing the results now. Reasonmachines.com I started with some stainless steel mesh. Check the link in the description below for my Amazon affiliate link to what I purchased. I used 20 mesh. The package came with three sheets of mesh. The sheets were 12 inches by eight inches. For the hydroponic system with 12 growth channels, one sheet of mesh is enough for this for how you'll need to cut it. The other pieces of mesh you can use for other things like lining your shower drain. This is a much cheaper alternative. Since the nutrient solution only flows along the bottom half of a growth channel, each growth channel only needs to have a half circle of mesh cut to fit as a filter screen. For each growth channel, measure and cut the mesh into a half circle with a radius of 2 inches. Installing the mesh is a bit tricky. It will require bending the mesh a bit to fit through a plant hole. The mesh can rest inside the channel just before the drain hole. Now I've had these mesh filters in place for the past two months, and I have not had a single channel plug from debris in that entire time. Even with the screens collecting debris, there is enough surface area that nutrient solution could flow through the system, mostly uninterrupted. If something big gets caught in the filter, it is easy to remove and clean it before reinstalling. If you have built a garden like this one, I highly recommend installing a mesh screen filter like this one to mitigate channel plugs. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button. Check the description below for the link to the mesh screen and a link to my guide on how to build this garden. Do not forget to subscribe to Greens and Machines if you want to learn more about this garden and leave a comment below if you have any more questions regarding this system.